maybe one of the best ways to describe voluntary virtue is that we help people who like to live voluntary lives and appreciate others who do the same. We just want to help that group of people. And so we are kind of a, a central meeting place for people who would like to donate to those who need help and for those who do need help to come and, and get a little helping hand to make them better, more capable. And our hope is, of course, that we don't contribute to the welfare state or to, to the revolving circle of poverty. Uh, our hope is that people who need some help today that we will be able to help them in a meaningful way, not just by handing them free stuff that they're not going to appreciate and that, that makes them softer as productive humans. But we hope that we can help those people grow so that they will someday be the ones that are making the big donations to voluntary virtue. That's our hope. Uh, maybe that's optimistic. Maybe we're a little bit naive, uh, but we're kind of dreaming of a better world. And then we said, hey, let's not dream about it. Uh, let's actually do what we can to make it happen. And, and I think about it, and I often speak about how I don't like the welfare state. And I've heard many of my conservative and libertarian friends saying the same thing. And I've heard many of my friends that are more left-leaning or, or Marxist say that, that they think that, you know, that some people just don't give enough. And then I, I thought, am I just going to take a back seat or should I step up and say, hey, I want to participate in benevolence and goodwill and helping others and, and in the whole, whole charitable uh, realm of life. And of course I do. So that was the reason when I was uh, so fortunate to be asked to be a, a founding board member of this organization, I was thrilled to say yes and, and get involved. And, and I encourage you to do the same. It's easy for us to sit back and say, you know, the government's just creating all of these welfare folks that aren't ever going to be productive and aren't going to do anything. And I'm not putting my money toward that. Well, we're kind of here to say we're going to be having some projects that you probably do want to donate toward. Do you want to donate toward helping people become more self-reliant? People who are doing what's right, people who are living their lives according to the non-aggression principle, people who are living peaceful, productive lives, aren't those the ones that you want to help? That's that's who I want to help. That's who I want to spend my time with and, and sometimes get a hand from and sometimes give a hand to. So if you would like to join us, please do so. We welcome your involvement in whatever way you would like to be involved. Thanks for listening and thanks for getting involved.